What's up guys? Welcome to another Tuesday tip. Today we're going to go over another one of my favorite triceps exercises. Um, I've shown you all my all-time favorite in the, uh, the cup extension, so I wanted to show you all my other favorite tricep exercise. And to be honest with you, these two exercises have probably made up like 90% of my tricep work for the last two years. Um, and I know causation doesn't equal correlation, but my triceps aren't too bad. So never ask the guy with a good body part how he got them, right? Anyways, let's go over this. So the cool thing about this exercise is if you do the uh, other variation that I said I really like, which is the, you know, over cuff extension, this is a great way that gives you a really braced, stable way to do a tricep exercise with your humerus, you know, elevated. I'm not going to say overhead because I'm not going to get overhead, but definitely above 90. So um, definitely training it from a different angle. Um, Reason I like doing it on the cuffs is the same reason I like doing most of my exercises on the cuffs is it allows us to get a degree of joint alignment that we aren't able to get doing it any other way. Um, especially, you know, if you're trying to do like a rope or a dumbbell overhead like that. Um, really poor piss poor alignment, really piss poor, you know, uh, lines of force. So um, this exercise really kind of addresses all that. You'll see once I get in and I kind of give you all the nuts and bolts instruction, I'll show you whenever you line those cables up, you're able to get like literally perfect alignment down your arm. So we really minimize uh, torque at the elbows and really able to keep as much in the triceps as possible. So let me show you what it looks like. Um, this exercise has like a little bit of a dance to get into it, if you will. And that is left hand, left side. Take it, give it a nice like full spin. Then you're gonna get the other one. And what you're going to end up with is the uh, left cable in your right hand and the right cable in your left hand. And you're going to get here, get in the seat. And you're able to see, we're able to get really good alignment with those cables running right down the arms. And we're able to get good flexion, seeing I can't bend my elbow anymore, can't get any more angle than if I wanted to. We're able to get out to full extension. We're also having a great resistance profile here. That cable's about 90 degrees with my forearm when we're in full flexion, which means the resistance is greatest here. And as we extend and that cable gets closer to the arm, the resistance will drop off uh, mechanically. So good profile, great alignment, awesome exercise. And I'm actually training arms today. So I'm about to full send a set of this, so I'll show you what like a full set, uh, full send, full intensity set looks like shortly. Hey, to the end now. Let's go. Yeah, come on, have it out. Come on. We need to work in it. Come on. Easy. There we go. Number one. Go. Have it up. Number one. Here we go. Come on. Big try. Number one. In it. Again. Come on, Hunter. Come on. Double. Big try. Yes, 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 yes. So that's what the full send set looks like. Um, something to be said, you don't have to have this exact cables to do it. Um, you just don't want to do this in like a normal eight stack, like with them way wide apart. Um, what's going to work best is the little free Moshi army guys. You can like set them uh, to be like this one or those uh, life fitness close cables that are approximately this wide that you see in a lot of like LAs and lifetimes and stuff. So uh, it doesn't have to be a prime stack. So keep that in mind. If y'all like this Tuesday tip, be sure to subscribe. Doing our best to put one out every Tuesday, along with weekly Q&As and then weekly uh, long-form videos, whether it be posing, gym, training, outside of the gym stuff, whatever. Moral of the story, we're bringing y'all as much content as possible, especially now that we are full steam underway with the Olympia prep. So appreciate y'all following along. See y'all next week.